This is Miss Chris with the Scott Township Public Library for another episode of Science Friday. And today we are making something because 4th of July is coming up and we're gonna maybe see fireworks. We're gonna make fireworks in a glass. Now you don't need a lot for this experiment. All you need is a clear glass. It needs to be clear so you can see through it or a jar, water, a bowl, vegetable oil, or any kind of cooking oil, and food coloring. Any color you want your fireworks to be. This is gonna determine the color of your fireworks. Okay, so what you do first, first you take your clear glass and you fill it three quarters of the way with water, or almost all the way full with water. Okay, you good? Next, you're gonna take your cooking oil and pour just a little bit <clears throat> into your bowl. Then, this is the fun part, and it could also be the messy part, so get some help from a parent or guardian. You're gonna take uh, your firework colors, your food coloring, and just put some dots of it in your water. I'm doing pink. Woo, that was a lot. Pink, and how about purple? And let's do, what do you think? Green? Okay, <clears throat> now, if you look at your oil, you're gonna notice that the food coloring did not dissolve in the oil. It stayed in little drops of food coloring. That's because food coloring does not dissolve in oil. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna you're not gonna really mix. You just wanna break those big chunks of food coloring into smaller little chunks. Because the big chunks won't do what, what we want them to do. Okay, mix, mix, mix. Break, break, break. Break those food coloring chunks into smaller little chunks. Smaller little globules. Okay, now when you look at your food coloring and your oil now, you should have just a bunch of tiny little food coloring globules or circles. Okay, now this is the fun part. We're gonna see if it worked. <clears throat> and then I'm gonna explain what happened. All right, let's see what happens when we dump the oil and the food coloring into the water. You ready? I'm ready, I'm excited. Hopefully we're gonna see some fireworks. There they go, look at them, fireworks. How cool. Wow. There they go, they're igniting. Beautiful, look at that, look at those colors. They're gonna keep going. Now I'll tell you why this is happening. The oil, and the water, they're different densities, which means the water is heavier than the oil. So the oil stays on top of the water, but the food coloring sinks out of the oil into the water. And then what you're seeing when you see the fireworks is, and you still see them, look at them. Look at that, that's so pretty. Is you're seeing the food coloring dropping out of the oil and dissolving in the water. Very cool, look at, oh, look at that purple firework. Red one, oh, that was cool. I hope you enjoy these fireworks and I hope you enjoy real fireworks somewhere. Although these ones are a lot quieter than the, than the real ones, right? But both of them are really fun. Happy 4th of July and stay tuned next week. Remember, Mondays we have Make It Monday where we make a craft. Wednesdays we have family story time and then Friday is always science Friday where we do a fun science experiment and make sure you sign up for summer reading. If you enjoyed this video, click subscribe. Look at all these fireworks still going and we will see you soon. Bye.